And tonight at 10, a senseless loss of life. Six weeks after being shot in the head, 10-year-old Sierra Guyton has died. On that day in May, Sierra was just doing what kids do, playing in the playground. Thank you for joining us. I'm Shannon Sims. And I'm Charles Benson. Sierra got caught in the crossfire of two men fighting over clothes. Todd Hicks spoke with Sierra's father. Todd joins us now near the playground where this tragedy happened. Todd. Well, Charles and Shannon, Sierra Guyton's father tells me his little girl could just not hang on anymore. This is a playground where that shooting happened last May. Now tonight he's leaning on, leaning on other family members for emotional support, but he admits it's rough. I didn't know it's so good, you know. Anwan Guyton and his family say they're hurting after learning of the death of their 10 year old daughter, Sierra. I never thought I'd go through something like this, you know what I mean? And I got four kids, and I never thought that I would have to, you know, end up burying my child over something that she didn't even do from playing at the park. Guyton had been hospitalized since last May after being caught in the crossfire of a gunfight between two men. The family took her off life support on June 25th and says there were signs of hope. She was progressing, so, you know, I was getting used to that, you know what I'm saying? So this was, this was real sudden for me. Sierra's family had been called to Children's Hospital after doctors let them know that her condition looked grave. Around 1.30 Sunday morning, the little 10-year-old took her final and last breath. Dozens of family and friends came to the site of the family home and where the shooting happened to show their support after word of her passing. Right now, her dad wants his daughter to know one thing. Just meet me when I get there, baby. You know, just wait on me. She don't have to deal with the roguishness of the world anymore. You know, she at peace. A very rough and emotional day for that family out here today. Now, a vigil will be held right here across from the family home and at the playground where that shooting happened. It'll begin tomorrow night at 745. We're live at 28th and Clark tonight. Todd Hicks, today's TMJ4. And certainly the community shares that father's pain. Thank okay. you, Todd. It is a pain, as you said, shared by all. Well, as Todd mentioned, Sierra Guyton was shot on the Clark Street playground back in May. She was removed from life support a few weeks ago, and overnight she passed away. Now, two men have been charged in connection with that shooting, 18-year-old Sylvester Lewis and 28-year-old Jamie Jackson. Both have criminal records and will be watching to see if charges will be amended now that Sierra has died. Well,